Lister fucking put it so well that he said that he's not trying to change the world, he's just reacting to the world trying to change him. And I think that's a really fucking cool way of putting it. I am word to mother. I feel uncomfortable with the term artist because the sort of people that use it are generally wankers. And I, I, I classify myself as an illustrator, primarily. A, a fine Bic biro in a sketchbook. That's, that's my favourite shit all day. And you can just like, create this catalogue of wicked drawings or whatever. That's what I like to do. Yeah, without knowing your surroundings shape you and, and they continue to shape you as you travel and, and move about. In terms of graph, it was before the internet, everything was regional and I used to go to Brighton. People like Nylon and Arrow, Jerk, you know, people like that in the late 90s, that, that really influenced my graffiti. I was never fully on painting that outdoors really, but I like the idea of a pseudonym. I like not using your own name because I don't think it's important who I am necessarily or, or what I look like or any of that shit. I mean, I'm not opposed to having my photo out there or whatever, but I don't like it to be at the forefront. I'd started writing like words to your mother and stuff, just as like a tongue in cheek, sort of like 90s hip hop nod above like my pieces. And then ironically, I'd start writing it and obviously writing it over and over again until I came up with the way that I write words to mother now, which has become my new graph name, if you like. It's kind of become graffiti again. That's where the addiction in it is. It's just like the obsession with it. It's come full circle. I mean, it's a pain in the ass to write a 12 letter tag. It's ridiculous. <laughs> so that's why like, I'll piece just mother if I piece now, but yeah. And it's not something like you switch into it consciously. You just kind of, well, I do. I just do it and then it starts to happen and then it's, and then it's happening and then it's done, <laughs> basically. It can kind of sometimes be a blur and I look back and I'm like, oh shit, I did that. And you were just, I don't know, just in the moment doing it. Like I said, I lived in the Mission for in the Mission District of San Francisco. Translate that message visually. The concept drives the the medium and the aesthetic.